welcome to World of Asphalt 2013. Nice to have you here. This year we're introducing the BW138 with Economizer. The BW138 is a tandem steel wheel roller, 54 inches wide. This year with the Dash 5 model, we have a larger diameter drum to make it that much more improved as far as, as, as getting smoothness and density. Bowmag has been mounting transducers, accelerometers on drums for almost 40 years. Bomag does this so that the information can, can be gathered by the drum because the drum's vibrating, the drum's active. You're going in, coming out of material, whether it's asphalt, soils, it goes in and comes out, and sooner or later, it stops going in. As you build density, at the same time, you build stiffness. And through stiffness, we can read that through the action of the drum. What the economizer has done, as you can see from this video, is that we read these lights on the dash very simply, you may make your first pass, you get two lights light up, make your second pass, four lights light up, third pass, six lights light up. Now, if your, let's say, fourth, fifth pass is too many, the red light will come on. What does the red light mean? It means that you've made too many passes. I know that sounds very simple, but one of the biggest problems I see is that when you, you overroll material, you have a tendency to overroll for whatever reason, and when you do that, the, the guy is burning extra fuel he doesn't need to burn. He's tearing up the material, and he's tearing up the machine. With the economizer, with this light system, it tells us that we've given the material all it's gonna take. It's not gonna take any more. As soon as that red light comes on, you know where you are. Also, if you have other gauges, for example, a nuclear gauge on this job to compare it to, it may be that six lights lit up is enough and all you need to give you the kind of results that you're looking for. You know, smoothness and density. A 54-inch roller, we're usually talking about possibly a, uh, a residential commercial area, and not a whole lot of attention usually is paid here when it comes to uh, any kind of measuring device. And we're only talking about a, an item that's around $1,500 add or so to the machine, and that's off the top of my head. Uh, you still have a roller. There are two things, the measuring device being the economizer and the roller itself. I say that because if you don't like or you don't want to use it, you still have a roller. You're not setting a testing device on the shelf and not utilizing it. And vice versa, while you're rolling, it's extremely efficient to have a testing device on board to tell you exactly where you are. One of the largest problems with failures in commercial work is really what you're working on. There's been no improvement to the base or the sub-base, plus the sub-base or the base may have a hydraulic problem, there's water down there, there's organic things down there, there's tires buried down there. There are problem areas that you can't compact. You can't compact water, you can't compact old tires. Uh, let's find out about these problems before we enter into this with hot mix. Because hot mix is not, or even warm mix, is not an inexpensive item. Let's make sure that this base is good by proof rolling the area with the unit before we even put the mix down. That'll tell us in what areas we have soft spots. And finding the soft spots, arriving at what the problem is and making improvements on those soft spots really is uh, worth its weight in gold as far as I'm concerned. It puts you way ahead. To put down three inches of gravel and then come back with two, three, four inches of asphalt and then find out two years from now that you have a problem is not a very efficient way of going about doing this. Now let me ask everybody, everybody watching this, have you ever seen a problem in a parking lot? Sure you have. The alligators, uh, the potholing, that generally speaking is, is an organic material coming up or it's water that's coming up that was a problem to begin with and was never solved. Something like this from the beginning can tell you what the problem is. You can find it, identify it, and then discover it. So it, uh, it's a real benefit to anybody who wants to partake uh, and we have plenty of them and would like to, um, to do business with them. Again, this is Chris Connolly. I'm product manager here at Bowmag for the asphalt equipment. And, you know, we're at World of Asphalt. Uh, this is the BW138 AD-5 with the economizer. Uh, we have them ready to go. Uh, the machine will help you in terms of discovering what your problems might be out there. Plus, while you're building this lifted material, it'll help you uh, work through that. And uh, you have a nice day.